It's amazing because it was impossible to do this. It was impossible. Every engineer, every consultant, everyone told us it is impossible to rebuild LaGuardia Airport while you operate LaGuardia Airport. It was impossible. Why? LaGuardia is very small as airports go. It's about 680 acres. Uh, Denver Airport, the last new airport, 35,000 acres was Denver Airport. And we are in the midst of building an entirely new LaGuardia Airport, the first totally new airport in the United States in 25 years. We're tearing down every single passenger building, with the exception of the landmark Marine Air Terminal, and building a new state-of-the-art airport worthy of New York. Now here you see what the fully com completed Terminal B with its two island concourses at the western end of the airport will look like. But turning back to Delta's world-class Terminal C, beyond this concourse, which is remarkable, Delta will now work to complete its own extraordinary new arrivals and departures hall along with three additional concourses. <laughs> Because I can remember 15 years ago where we had four gates here on the old Concourse D, four gates. And today, Delta is the largest airline at LaGuardia with 275 flights a day. This is also our 50th anniversary of serving LaGuardia. We started with six DC-9s back in 1969. And so it's fitting that we're opening up the new, the new concourse here. Uh and while this is just the start, uh, there's, there's three more fingers to follow. We, we look forward to over the next 18 to 24 months continuously, the governor says 18, I say 24 months, continuously uh, building new, new access ways and new openings to, uh, to LaGuardia.